Hi guys, this is Shai Sweet, and in this video I'm gonna show you how you 3 star stage 1 7 in Guardian Tales and also how you find the secret passage in the same level. So stage 1 7 can be a little bit tricky if you don't know where to find the last purple coins and the treasure chest. So I'm gonna show you where to find them. So let's get to the world map and find stage 1 7. It's here on the right side of the map. It's the last stage of the first world and once you've done it you will have finished all the main quests as well in the, in the first world. It's called Champion's Sword, so let's enter. So once you get here the first thing you need to do is just finish this first fight. This is gonna be the only fight in the, in the stage until you reach the end. And then you get into the actual maze. This is the first screen and the, the first issue you will notice is that if you take the wrong turn here, like go uh, down at the first screen, you will just end up at the beginning again and you will have to start the whole thing over. And that's going to be like that for every screen you find. But the trick is really easy. All you need to do is to follow these white handkerchiefs on the ground to find the right way. So let's do that. I'm gonna run through here real quick. And once you get here, you're out of the maze. And if you're here for the main quest, you're gonna want to go up. But don't forget to go down. Because down here on this screen you will find uh, a few purple coins and also a star piece over here at the end. Over here will the star piece be. So don't forget to do that before you finish the quest or you will have to come back later. And then we're gonna go, I'm gonna show you the, the tricky part of this, the really tricky part of this stage. And that is here at the end, once, once you've finished the, the boss of the level and you find the sword that sits here. Don't forget to go up here beside where the sword is. There's a secret passage here that you can't see very well and it's very easy to miss. And here's where you find the treasure and the last purple coins. And that is how you 3 star this stage. But that's not all that there is to it. There is also another secret passage in, in this level, in this stage, that you need to know about. So let's go back to the, uh, the world map and I'll show you. We're back at the world map and as you can see down here there is a sub-stage uh, that is connected to stage 1-7. And that is kind of hard to, to know uh, if you don't know about it beforehand, but there is a secret passage inside stage 1-7 which I'm going to show you right now. Let me just run through here. Get rid of these. How about this? And we're back at the first screen of the maze again. And if you go to the map and look at the right corner over here where you found the last star piece and the, some purple coins, you can see that there, there's kind of a strange pattern here. It's a, like an arrow pointing up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right. So if you follow this pattern from the first screen in the maze, you will unlock the uh, hidden substage here. So let's do that. We go up and then up again and we go down and again down and from here we go left and then right and then left and then right again. And you will find this portal here that you can activate and that will lead you to the hidden substage on the world map. So that's how you 3 star this stage and also how you find the hidden stage. So if this was helpful for you, please give me a like and subscribe and see you next time.